میکنه اصلی 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 Those were inspired by Rebbe's in America to a superior status to Mark about the family of Shachar, Jael and Leslie Kaplan, and many of their parents. Mitch was splintered by Yosef Chaim Bechava, Hanan ben Moshe Ariel Bechana, Pesha by Shmuel Yitzchak Halevi Bechakori, Esher ben Yoel Moshe Akorin Bechakori, Rebbe turned to Gladys Sherman, Bishop Abnea, Michael Klein, and turned to Judith Klein, and Judith Klein ben Chaim, Marsha Braun, and many of her husband, Rabbi Rachel ben Shmuel. Family of Arthur Ritholtz, Mordechai Yehud ben Baruch Leibar Cohen, friends and family of Sidney Bessler, Shalom Shlaga ben Dov, friends of Marvin Weinstein, Mordechai Elza ben Mishorala, Sarah Alper, and many of her husband, Arav Shalitha ben Hill, Rex was friends of Maddie Friedman, and Lindo Miriam Bart, and so many Ruvain. <coughs> Months of learning by Susan and Ruvain Podolsky, and many of her father, from Kabuna ben Yeshua, Susan and Ruvain Podolsky, and many of her mother, Chaya Bar Avon Dov, Michael and Judith Koretsky, and many of his mother, Rachel Bat Avram, Jack Gilman, and many of his brother, Zev Yosef Ben Yitzchak. A week of learning by Isaac and Edenovic, and many of his father, Eliezer Yaakov Ben Mordechai Tzvi, Ruby Iger, and many of his son, Anto Yitzchak Ben Ahron. And today, being the 7th of uh, what, May, there are no individual days of learning. May the sun is happy, it's going to appear, though the Yeshua's mother is happy in Israel. A bridge against you. All right. Nine lines up. Thank you. Um, from the past summer's road. So yesterday we had different opinions on how much an ISTA, how much you have to, how much the the investing partner has to pay the working partner to offset this. They say that it's not ribbit that he's working his half in three. So now we're going to pass him. Later it will change, but it'll be passed in like. I'm Rav Nachman, I'm Rav Rabbi Yehuda. Actually, one halach of Rav Rabbi Yehuda. And what, even the smallest amount of compensation, either the guy dips his food into the guy's brine, or only if he eats, uh, you know, a, a dried fig, and even if they didn't make the yodas, you know, it's all enough to offset the the, uh, the work of the working partner and it's fine. Halach, he says, the halach of Rav Rabbi Yehuda, 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 he said what? That, that you can, you don't have to, that you're allowed to just uh, give over uh, sheep, uh, you know, goats and sheep to the herder, okay, and not worry about not worry about any compensation for the work. Why? Because the, the, the even the even the uh, the bad the, the water the yeah the water from the from the right uh, yeah even the we uh, you know, even the water we even the water, well wait that's the last one even the even even the water we, even the water from the kernels uh, milk. And even the little bits of uh, people that come off from the water, if it burns us or not. And that, that you don't have to pay any food when you give over the baby with the mother. So the, the, the combination of the work of the mother and the care of the mother is enough that you don't have to comp- uh, 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 that you don't have to compensate the uh, the herder. So now, the children of Vila, all of a sudden, after he died, they have a paper where it seems that he did the following. They had a Xibes written, Talga Baga Bagashe, that his father, the father had made a deal for half half loss and half and half um, and half profit. You know, like we say, the normal the normal profit. From, but we didn't see any, and we didn't see any compensation, so it looks like it's ribbit. So we have to defend, we have to defend after the fact. What did Ravilish do? Now, the truth is, we don't know whether Ravilish, we're, we're going to assume that right now the Ravilish uh, was the. Um, the Ravilish was the borrower. I'm Rabba, but Ravilish, Gavra Rabba, the Yisura Lidish Lahavi Safi. Okay, it was Gavra Rabba who, the Yisura Lidish Lahavi Safi. He wouldn't have given, uh, he wouldn't have given ribbish uh, for somebody. And therefore, what? It must be he was the wor- he was the borrower. And since he was a big rabbi, he couldn't possibly have what? Have have, have given to the, to, have, couldn't possibly have given to the lender his work, which would have been interest. Okay, and that's one way to learn. Tell the way is what? Well, he would take it, but he wouldn't even give it to somebody else. He certainly wouldn't take it, which case, in which case he was the lender. But either we're going to say, really, he was, he was the borrower. But the money shop, so therefore what? It has to be like this. When the paper says, I'm going to explain it outside, and then I'm going to send it to inside. The paper said half half um, profit and half loss. So we read it originally as what? That's the deal. Each guy gets half profit and half loss. They know we're going to read it differently. He either gets half profit or... He gets half loss. No, 
half profit, and the wool loss will be different. And he gets half loss, and the wool and profit will be different. Let's read it now, and it comes in a beautiful way. Manashah, this is what the paper actually says. If he's going to get what? If he's going to get half of the profit, so then Tilti the Hesed, okay? In other words, if he's going to get, he's going to get half of the profit, so therefore what? So then, then, the, then, the, then the lender is going to have to get what? The guy who gives over, the guy who gives over, the lender is going to give over, is going to get two-thirds of the loss, and he's only going to get one-third. So therefore what? Since he only has one-third of the loss, so one-half of the profit, he's getting paid. You understand? Because he only has one-third of the loss. Or similarly, he piled up the half of the other. No, let's let's pay it off with half of the loss. And tilt the dog, and he's going to get two thirds of the profit. So therefore, same thing again. So he's getting two thirds of the profit instead of what? Instead of one half of the profit, so he's getting paid. I'm not kind of kind of kind of this night that that made the Rav Zevi be like that. So he said this over in front of him. But I'm not really said to him. So I'm what do you? I have to in order to defend Rav Yehuda. Why do you have to say that was the case? So that, that that the paper is not what it says. It's not half and half. It's not half and half. So he was totally in the trouble. But he said, no, that actually was. He's written half and half. But the facts are that, that he that he dipped he, he dipped his his bread in the lender's uh, in the lender's uh, wine, and that was enough pay. And like he said, what well, okay uh, okay. Well, I'm not nothing. What's the sudden need? Because I'm not said that. What the need? What even if he didn't make the deal in the beginning? Even if he didn't agree to it? As long as ultimately. The borrower, the, and ultimately the borrower got some benefit, uh, some payment from the lender, even the minimal payment, that's good enough to offset the, to the interest. So he says, he says, no, he says, I know what he says, I'm not going to say this. He says, Rob Hickerson, the Nachman never gets to say this last time, that's the other way. And the truth is, I said the other way, he said, that's three people who hold and look to say, uh, essentially the same thing, and it's not the Allah. It's the other way. He mentioned three opinions that are essentially the same, and also you don't have to pay. You don't have to. You don't. You don't have to make it. You don't have to pay the big amount. You know to offset your this. No, they all said you pay small amount, and they're all not the halacha. You can't answer what the Rabbis were telling them. And Rabbi Nachman Mishabe made sense of what the Rabbi Nachman was never saying with those three of the halacha that he read originally, even if they must be. He don't say it that way. That he never meant to say it's not halacha, but rather he meant to say what? He, he, you don't say what? That he meant to say it's not halacha, but you don't say that he meant to say what? That it is halacha. Normally, in Nesha, they know halacha, halacha, halacha. Why have to say the three different opinions? Name halacha and Yehuda. Once he would have said the halacha is like Yehuda, that even without agreeing, that even getting the smallest amount of benefit, the borrower is not considered that to, to, to be paying to be paying interest for the work. Okay, to make a mukur. Once you say like Yehuda, who's the least, who, who, who's the most lenient, who's the most lenient, he certainly only ever did. And since he didn't do it, it must be the other way. He was enumerating the three to say all three are not the halacha, and that's what all three are not. I'm a rab, okay, now. So we have an interesting case. What, what, what's the halacha if the, if the, the lender, so to speak, or the investor, says what? The investor lender says what? Moshe Shuk is not. He says, listen, you're going to get, in order to offset this, I'll tell you what. You're going to get. You're going to get in addition to half of the profit, half of the loss. You're going to get everything that's above a third in improvement in, in profit belongs to you outright. Up to a third, we're going to split. Once it's more than a third, it's all yours. Everything more than a third. Now you realize that sounds like a good deal on condition that what? If it goes up more than a third, yeah. But if it doesn't go up a third, then the guy's not going to going to get anything. The guy's a mutter. That's mutter. Now what would it say? So remember, because we learned, we have an opinion. That what that, that that one side of where this is mutter. Remember, I said something last week that if it's only it, it, when it's into it's not echad. It's only one possibility. It's one. So since you're right, if it does make a third, it, it'll come down interest. But if it does make a third, well, that's enough. Yeah, that's not interest. So you said, oh, look, okay, that's okay. That's it. I look at because you're allowed to do that. Okay, uh, 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 you're allowed to you're allowed to uh, do that. Okay, but uh, okay. But he, he says, he, he, he says, more my says, he, he says, no matter what the shoes are, no matter what the shoes are, he's going to go empty handed. He's going to go empty handed. He says, what? Totally so, you know, he's going to have to pay him a dina, at least, at least, even if it's a small amount. But that amount, he has to really pay him at least a dina, because he can't really go on without any money. I have a son of a little bit of a dina, what's that? Tell me, a rob holds you. You are allowed to let the guy, you're allowed to make a good deal like that. If it's not a thing, he goes home empty handed. Oh, my rob, didn't rob say, rob once made a statement. Says, and, and, and the only way to interpret that statement is that you don't let the guy go home empty handed. Rob once said, Reisha, I didn't let the film know. He said, What? The head of the animal goes to the fat man. In other words, it goes, goes to the working partner. Okay, my lab. So what's the case? What's he, what's he, coming, to, what's he coming to tell me? He says, he says, he says, he says, he, he, I, 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 in what case is it going to make sense to say that? My lab, what's the case? 
that, that's not a normal kind of problem. It must be this is a case. Most of the speech is possible. It must be a case of what? We said everything above a third is going to be your pay uh, and what? And when it doesn't come to that, what do we mean? We have to pay him. We have to pay him the head. And that may you can be made for that amount of, for that little deal. You can do it. You can do it ahead of the amount. We're not saying that. No, but, but, but you don't let him go ahead as he handed. So you see what? That Rob does want to be paid. I'm going to go over. He wants to no, no. Rob never said that. Really, you can go home and empty handed. It's fine. Okay, it says, but Amalei, when do we say that you get the head? If when the guy said that you mote the tree, we raise your head with the Here's what happens. The deal was that the, that the investor made this deal. He said, listen, everything more than a third is outright yours to pay. Or alternatively, you get the head of the animal. And that's enough. Now, the head of the animal is enough. In this kind of deal, where it's, where it's not the most likely thing, etc., a head is enough to offset the work, and it's not considered the head. So one answer, the, the, the way we just answered now, so Rob really says, well, the guy can get all, the guy can go home at the end. But then, is, 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 is Rob can go home at the end. He might say, well, I can say no. You know what? I can say, really, you're right. The proof that you brought me is a proof that I have to re, we have to revise the original proof. Rob really holds, like you said, that we can't go home at the end. We can't go home at the end. You know, we don't need the head. I think I'm about to speak to Chuck and Mitchell. And Rob said, I'm going to that when he says everything more than a third is your is your pay, which uh, and, and, and it sounds like what, that, and if it comes out right, if it does not, I, I have to go back to So then this way, the Ama will be fulfilled. Here's the shot. When can you say to the guy, well, everything more than a third is yours, most likely go back to your hand? It's when, it's, when the, it's when the working partner has his own animal. It's not just the investor gave him an animal, but the worker has his own animal. The I mean, it's the people say, and he doesn't have to pay him for the work, right? It's not interest because the guy's going to pay him. The I mean, the people say double the tour. If you're really going to mix the feed for one cow, I'm going to say double the tour. You can mix it for, mix it for another cow. It's the same work. He wants you to do it for him. So it's, it's right. Rob said it. But not really what in two Rob holds. You can never send the guy home, uh, home empty-handed. You can't say more than a third is your pay, and if it doesn't come out to that, you're out. No. He, he just say to him, listen, the case is here where, where the guy has his own animal, so he never owed him for the work. So he doesn't have to offset the work because the worker he doesn't owe for it, so the worker's not even paid. So really, Rob is using a tool that you never send the guy home at the end. So we'll also make really Zavim Behem of the Arab Lady Yisrael. Now, once, once upon a time, now don't get confused here. Aris, you know, is a sharecropper. But this guy just happened to be a, this guy is a sharecropper, but this deal is not a sharecropper deal. The fact is, the sharecropper is going to be meaningful in a minute, but the deal is not a sharecropper deal. What happened was, the Velazna Gorla Zavim Behem of the Arab Lady Yisrael. Now, the Lord of the he bought, he bought an animal, and he gave it to his sharecropper. He said, you, here, you be the grower. You fatten it up, and we're going to make a deal 50-50. 50-50 loss, 50-50 gain. Okay? Okay? Mefatim lay. Okay? Revelation by grace. And the guy fattened it, and what? And, and the Lord gave him the head as his pay. You know, he called what Rob called. Okay? And he gave him half of the, of the, of the, of the profit. The way they agreed, okay, so I'm going to say that it was everything was good. It was all fine. It was, it was a normal Nisha. And we held in these cases, these kind of places where it's a, it's a single animal, these kind of things, a head is enough. Yeah, it's enough of a pay. You don't have to do these uh, bigger payments that we learned earlier. Okay. The other way called Rob, they paid him half because that half of it, he got, he got half of it. He got the whole head. Amelie de Bitu, so his wife says, oh, she's a smart lady. She's, she's, she's getting involved in the, in the husband's business deals. He says, listen, wait a second. He says, if you were just, if you were just a working partner, you were just a working partner. You got a head, but you only got half of the rest of the, uh, the rest of the profit. If you were partners, had you owned half, because you weren't a borrower in half, and a, 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 you would have been a true partner. You would get not only do you get a head, you get a head and a tail. Well, you know, in in in, in, in Israel, in the Middle East, the sheep have a fat tail. It's a big tail. It's a very it's a very valuable thing because they get, it's so fat. You, you're gonna I'm, you're gonna think I'm teasing, but I'm not. They they, they 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 put a wagon. They make a wagon just for the tail. You see by the Arabs, by the Arabs, you'll see a, a sheep. The the, the, the sheep herd is walking with the sheep, and then you hear a, you hear a noise. The sheep has got a, a little wagon just for its tail, and the wagon is rolling along underneath. The tail was an alga. It's called the alga. I used to see the big fatty thing. It's valuable, and it's something you know. It's soft and it's valuable. The big fatty tail called the alga. He said, listen, you'll get the head and you'll get the tail. If you're a partner, you'll do even better. If you're a worker, you get this. Nice, you'll, you'll be a partner, you'll do even better. Also, somebody, so now, so, so he took her advice, and he goes out, instead of what, being, being the working partner of a, of a half loan, a half loan, half of his investment, what does he do? He goes out and buys it. He, he's an actual partner for them. He doesn't need a loan of half of the animal. Why? He owes half of the animal. 
Here's a, he's half. He's a balabas. He's half owner, and 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 Rabbi Lazar is a half owner. Holy may also. So then, when it came time to, to this, he only got half of the of the tail. And, uh, okay, an uh, uh, Then he said to him, "It's only a pregnancy. And now let's split the head. He said, "What do you mean? He thought it's gonna be a whole tail, a whole head. That's gonna be half a tail and half a head. Yeah, half of those not as good as half of those not better than all those." Um, Omer Lacey said to him, "Hashka, me Kara, Nami, Nami, no." He said, "Wait, I don't even get as much as I got before. I'm getting half a tail and half a head. Before I get half a tail and I got a whole head. Now I'm getting half a tail and, 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 and half a head." Omar um, Lay said to him, "He said, yep, you're right. He said, you're, you're right. Why? He said, I don't even know. Last year, up until now, what the Diabi, all the money you had in your, what you had in the animal was what was a loan." And because your half of the animal was loaned to you, I was stuck because it looked like what? It looked like you're working for me to pay me for the loan. Okay, the little hobby you're gonna have to pay for it. So had I not given you more than I take, okay, a little bit more, Master Kribbit, because it looked like I'm paying it. It look, look, looks like what? That you're paying me interest for the half I lent you. Okay. Hashto should be that. So now no, now you're an owner, you're a bala bus. I got no problem. My comarca. So what, what, why should you get any more than me? 50-50. I said, what are you going to say? Trach, it's very important what? You worked a little more because you had to take the animal in and out, et cetera. In this time, we reached the Mar Ara Kamashabi Master. Now you're in real trouble because you are indeed my sharecropper. The custom is there we know sharecroppers generally afford certain conveniences to their to their landlord. Not because of this deal. But Fili Rabbi says, everybody knows that, that the sharecropper makes uh, fodder available. To the to the to the to the owner of the land, with, you know, for uh, 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 gratis. He says, "Here, he says, there's no problem. You're a balabas, and I don't owe you because you're a sharecropper. This, this is all the services you provide to me. So therefore, I don't have to pay you. I don't have to pay you for feeding for, for, for feeding my my animals, my investment. We're for 50 50. That's right. You're worse off than used to be. You're worse off than used to be. When 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 you were when you were a borrower, I had I had offset I had offset your work. When you're a balabas, your partner doesn't have to. Son of a we learn." The following: a some a some name of a guy made a deal 50-50. He knows he evaluated the animal. The animal's worth 150-50, and and they and they and they made a deal 50-50 for the, the animal fattening and growing and the, the babies. How long does the how long does the does the grower have to keep growing it? Yeah, what's the deal? Simple. So a mare by some shlosh and What's the minimum? What's the minimum amount you have, you have to keep growing? You have to stay in the deal. Remember, in every year you have to work harder because the animal eats more. Take take more work. He says. He says. He says. Simcha says what when it comes to uh, uh, donkeys. Okay, eighteen months. The dojos by by sheep and and goats. That's the rabbi for this twenty four months. In bala fourth he wants to he wants to dissolve the deal to split up the you know uh, split up all the profits etc. In the, in the middle of that time, chaveru ma'akeroi. The investor can tell him no. You can't. You can't stop. In a doma, okay, the kula shall eat from the kula shall shall not perish. It says, however, the work of the first year is not like the work of the second year. No, the cost, it, it, the guy has to work harder, uh, uh, okay, and and, uh, and 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 the animal needs more more work the second year than the first. Now that that doesn't make any sense. The, the way that it's written is a non technical. He said, "My able to come." What do you mean? What do you mean? But not but. What do you mean? Because. That's why you can't break up because the guy expects you, the, the work grows. You, we expect more, more. We expect more and more. You can't, you can't let it go. You can't break off in the middle. The Gemara says, "What?" Says Ellie, "You're right. You have to read it this way." Right. Since the work of the first year is not like the work of the second year, so therefore, what? The guy can't stop before, before the full piece. Okay. Uh, uh, the full piece. Tanya uh, Ida. We learn furthermore. I saw I saw the hammer of Chaver. A guy made a deal 50-50 for an animal with his friend. He was the investor. I must say the Chazkin for the Chalder of Lagos. How long does the working partner have to deal with the babies? Remember, the babies is Chalder. So once the babies come out, he says, "Listen," he says, "I don't want to keep working working your working your thing anymore. I want to stop. And if you want me to keep working your babies, it's a new deal. Okay, you understand? I don't want to keep working the babies on the old deal." So, no, but why, why? Because he'll benefit. Be, be, you realize because if he, if he can dissolve the deal and he keeps working with the guy's babies, then he's got he's going to have a right to what? He's going to have a right to half of the a profit in the babies. He get half. He's going to he, he, he's going to he's going to have he's going to have a right to get uh, get the sort of he had three quarters as you're going to see. Okay, so this is the doctor, the shloshim yo. So how long does he have to keep dealing with the babies? 
So buy, buy, uh, buy sheep and goats, very good. But also buy big animals like like uh, cows and, and uh, cows and uh, horses and all this other stuff. Chamishim uh, fifty goats. So you also remember that the place of the first time. Yes, yeah, says no. Says by by sheep and goats you have to do truma. Why the place is the truma is because why because they they have to, they they need a lot of a lot of care. I keep full of truma. What is the message? What do you mean? What does it mean? They need a lot of care. It's nature. She knows that because the babies, the baby sheep and goats, have very little teeth. That's what they and that's what they want. So therefore, uh, uh, so they need uh, they need a mother and they need somebody to watch over them. You need the Barbados care for that care, but therefore you need what? Therefore you need truma. Now after that, so it, once the time is up, no to master shemot. So but then, so what, once the time is up, you work from try to get the get shisha, whatever the the, the the chetzi in the chetzi of the gets half of the half of the sentence. He ends up with two quarters. Why? Because that's in the deal. He's getting half of the half. So he's getting, he's getting half of the other. He's getting half of the other guy's. Uh, um, he, get, he, he gets a new half of the continued growth of his friend's profit. He now gets half of the continuing growth. You understand what? Because we, why? Because he's going to end up getting three quarters of everything that's a continuing. It's just a new deal. Rabbi Nasha Bagada, this Rabbi Nasha Bagada was was shepherding, uh, uh, okay, uh, traveling, okay, his friend's animal, okay, and the babies were there. Okay, after that, Shekhar left the shul. So what he did was, he all of a sudden, he divided them, he dissolved them, he took his half, and he started taking away half and half of his friend. He, he, he dissolved it, and so at that point, he says, okay, you, you, I'm re, 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 re-evaluating, recalibrating, and I get half and half? So he said, let's continue. After the coming day, by the way, he came to Rabbi Abaya, Abaya said to his shepherd, he said, I'm going to say, he I'm telling you, he says, okay, but who made the division? This is this is this is a commodity. You can't just make a division by yourself. You said it's a real deal. If your friend wasn't there making the division to make sure it was fair, then the, you can't dissolve by yourself. And since you can dissolve by yourself, you continue in your same half half to the relationship as before. Okay, but number one, because one, we don't know if if, if it was there. The old Okay, this is a place where they continue growing more. It's not Mokhesh Magalagadu. This is a place where they grow to, to much further. You have to worry. He says, look, on two counts you're out. One, you can't you can't dissolve a commodity deal on your own half because nobody knows if it's a fair dissolution. You understand? So then you, the deal continues. So your partner's there, but you know, that's a fair, a fair 50-50. And besides, you're saying that this is a place where you grow the animals longer. You're obligated to grow them. Either way, you don't get to dissolve it and get a new a new deal with his partner. Anu trade Kutai, there were two people from Kutai. So Abu Ishka and Kadu Abadu, they get into the 50-50 deal. Also Kadu Abadu, one of them went out, okay, and Kalu's visa below died for the Kadu. But if this is a monetary deal. You know, saying this is a deal, well, you know, yeah, we, we put the money in, and we're uh, invest, we're partners, you know, we're investing the money and making money. He divided the money without his friend's knowledge. After the Kadu had Kaka, he came in front of the Kadu. So I'm going to say to him, you know, now the guy protested, the, the, the other partner protested and said, listen, the, 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 the investor went and said, listen, you can't make a division without me. The deal will continue. In other words, the way what happened was this guy divided it and then continued working only his money and, 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 and making money. So that's what you have to do, and I get half of, the, I get half of what you make. Uh, I'm reading a little differently than other people read. This is like the Miriam. Okay, but not different. It's like the Miriam. Uh, the people who doubt me are reading it differently. It means what? Here, the guy said, listen, Got a hundred. There's 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 five hundred in the kitty. The deal's off, and now I'm working my two fifty myself, and I get all the profit from what you make. His partner came and said, "Look, Rabbi, you dissolved yourself. I'm not going to do it. The deal's on, and every and every bit of money you made on your two fifty, I still get half. I still get half. Why? Because the deal's not up until we divide it. So he says to the to the to the came to Akaka. The Akaka said to the guy who protested the division. He said, "My nafkini, man. What's the difference to you? Offer uh, offer and I'll knock one." So, okay, Zuzi, to my Napoleon, the Nakhon says money, darling, it's always like they're divided around because because you don't need any evaluation. The value of money is money. The value of each sheep, you don't know what this is worth more, this is less. Uh, uh, sheep, commodity, you don't know what they are. But, but money's money. Lashana, so the, so the guy lost. The protester lost the case. Lashana, on next year, Zov and Kamra Zavu, the same two partners went back into business. They were still, I guess they still work together. They bought wine together. Now they're now they're in the wine business together. They got barrels of wine. Tell me that again. The, 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 now, the one who last year who, who protested his friend dividing it, he now decided to dissolve the business on his own. He divided the, the business up without his partner. He now goes on to start making money with his half on his own, with his half of wine. After the company, now he came to, 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 to a judge in the front of the company. And the other partner is protesting the division. Um, 
by later, Papa said to him, Man, Papa, you have to say to the guy, so two devices. The second, how do you buy without your partner? He says, Amr Lay, he says, Papa Zina. The boss says, You say, he says, Your division is no division. You, and, and, and your partner continues to get profit from your from, from your work, from what you did. Amr Lay says to him, Pazina, the boss says, You're too cocky, man. He says, I see, I see, I see, I see, the, the rabbi is very careful. He says, Listen, coming after me. Whatever I say, you messed it up. Last year, you went against me. When I protested the division, you said I was wrong. Now, when he protested the division, you say he's right and I'm wrong. Every, I'm always wrong. He's always right, I'm always wrong. I'm a Rapapa. Rapapa is like this. He says, you know, he says, Baha'i Gavna, Rabbi Sarah for Rabbi. He knows this, the Baha'i and the Rashi explain it easily. He says, he's litigant, but it's Hesha. It looks like it looks like he's, he's not being straight. He has to explain it. This is how judicious he is. Listen, listen. He says, he says to him, he doesn't say he needs to. He says, Zuzi Shokal Tabi Rishabi Kashi. Me Shokal Tabi Rishabi Kashi. That was pretty. Did, did, did one guy get, get, get the whole coin? Did one guy got half coin? Either he says yes, he says, either he says no. But the point is, he says, look, he says, by money, it was the fair division. There's no problem. He says, he says, I'm a kuli, I'm a rabbi. When it comes to wine, everything has bika, the gashi bika, the rabbi. Some barrels are, are, are more tasty, some barrels are less tasty. But he says, you can't just divide them 50 50. You can't spend because, spend because, because you don't know it's fair. He said, to, to, to a person to unilaterally divide the money, you can't work because money's money. And he said, but uh, you know, money's money. And that's why I said, that's why I said last year that the division is there. Here, when you unilaterally divide wine, wine is not wine. One barrel of wine is quite a different value than another barrel of wine. And therefore, and therefore what? If I did, I, 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 therefore, I, I, therefore, I have power to protest against the division. But I'm not against you in case you need me. Yes. Yes. Now it's funny that they read it that way. I I didn't learn that way. I learned too far. The 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 Yuck Bemlin learned that Pika was a place. But the, I, he, he didn't learn it because he's a Pikin. He didn't say it. If somebody says it, they said it. But he said no. He says he says no. Too far here. He says you know the Yuck Bemlin says it's it's from it's from two um, two two people from the town of Pika. That's why I wrote that way. So that would make it better. And you're right. It's surprising, but you should know that the other way. The Kutim were positive. They were willing to buy anything. They were willing to do anything. The Kutim, the Samaritans, you know, the, 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 the bad Samaritans, the, the bad Samaritans, because the Kutim are enemies of the, uh, enemies of the, of the religious Jews. But uh, I wanted to know something that I had two friends. I, 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 I love them dearly. They were two Sephardic rabbis in Jerusalem. Yitzchak and Yitzchak. They were taken to learn in a place upstairs. Each floor was taken up to the higher level. There was a, a Kohler. Basically, every Kohler was on this place. It was Beit Shabbat. I used to come down there. Every day, Shabbos or something, I used to come down here to learn. So they would come down to argue out with other Kohlers. You know, they used to see who else was supposed to be on that Kohler. It was a field trip. Anyway, I became a good friend. I, I, I loved these guys. I was helping them. But they used to run a Beit Shabbat. But they came to learn Hashem. They did not. That was that was a critical point. They had such respect for these rabbis. But Gnasi said the big the business line of Gnasi said Gnasi used to say there were two rabbis in Israel. Last time I was in Israel, two rabbis. He said you know it's uh, when things are good, things are good. When you do it, when things are right, they're really right. But uh, for 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 the you know I I, I love huh. Oh, yeah, we would say, well, today everything's all organized and bureaucratic. They say, well, they have this because they sort of made moves. They made an appointment. But they, they came to them. They came. I had it here. I had it in America. They called, they actually called, a, I think the person was a woman. She didn't know who was she was calling. She was a lot of space. So she called any rabbi she could find. She called a rabbi who didn't speak English. <laughs> he called me. He said, I don't know Sarah. So take this, uh, take this call. So I took the call. It's a lady with a lot of space. She said, you, you, I can't even see about 2,000. I'm on the lawn. I'm everywhere you can give me a job. Uh, the economy is bad. Every, 
Why do you need Jim Carrey? Lady Carrey has the best voice in the world. She said, Because this is she says, I'm up here. She says, I'm having a dispute in the workplace. And uh, I can't write the opinion of what happened to Texas in the city. I said, I'll try it, huh? Tell me what happened. So she told me that she was having a divorce with her employer. The boss, she comes out of the house, the boss is demanding more and more work from his workers. And he's giving them work, which is beneath their salary. I think they were highly trained. I think he had them doing some data entry or things like that. It's probably like, you know, beneath that. So she says, I took the work from her. She says, Look, I want to talk to my boss. And my co-workers are saying that I'm doing the wrong thing because I'm ruining the uh, I'm ruining the circumstances for them. She said, I want to know if they're doing the wrong thing or not. So I said, you know, let me look into it. I'll, I'll tell you about it. Next week. So I try to own my own book. Most of books I want to see the book about. But I asked her, this is my opinion. I asked her if she was a part of a union. She said, was it, was, was it, was it unionized? She said, no. I said, if there's no union, if you're not bound by any union contract, then it's just your right to do that. And uh, they can do what they want with you about us. You know, it's like trying to do what you You know, union, by us, they are giving, and workers can, they, they can uh, enforce rules on their on each other. I said, they did. No, no, that's the rules they can. Anyway, it's just a really disagree with you. But anyway, but that's interesting. Yeah, I'm looking in the right place, I think, the, 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 the real, the, the, if you look at the, the golden age of the Jewish people in America, when people came from all over the world there to see us and they had to meet, they said, these are just the people that I know. Here you meet Jews, they just don't know how. They said, people are still able to have people that I know. That, that was the golden age of the Jewish people. And then when the whole world knew that, the whole world knew that, that the Jews were possessed with justice and, uh, and, and morality, etc., they said, they've been begging the people. People said, that's what they do. That's what they that's the, that's the, the Abraham. Where do you mean it? That's what we're getting hit into with things like this. So you're, you're thinking that people think of the redemption as, you know, the fireworks. It's like, that's, 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 that's five and dime stuff. That's nickels and dimes. I hope I'm communicating. That's nickel and dime stuff. You think, you think all the fireworks, that's the big deal? The big deal is going to be that the whole world is going to know that this is the word of God. And they're going to the whole world to know this is justice and this is kindness. And they're going to the whole world to look at the Jews now. That's, that's what people with the B'nai and Ayah, that's what we're looking for. That's what we're hoping for. Anyway, we're on history. The Jews always want to be like growing. Yeah, yeah. you want the other way. You want the guy. You want the guy to be like the Jews. It's not true. Okay. Anyway, okay. So the group of Amar Abdak and Jews who command the Bible. One second. There's much. What do you want? You can talk all you want. Is money always considered automatically divided? Okay. So you said in Sefer, we want to explain. We have to want to. We want to. We want to modify it. I mean, when you say what it is, it's automatically, you know, you, you don't need, you don't need, so to speak, to be over, to oversee the division of the money. I mean, really, how does it happen? That's what all the coins are the same. Now, there's two types of, there's coins that are current and coins that are heavy. So the current coins are better, a better uh, for trading, and heavier coins are better if you want to use them for weight. You understand? Or heavier coins are better for weight. So he's talking. Talk, so when when can you when is the the money? So long as money is money and not a commodity. So for example, tabi the tabi, current coins and current coins, pekuli for the pekuli, or heavy coins and heavy coins. So this is the bottom up. What's the difference? Avo. So everybody, so everybody's getting everybody's getting everything. Okay, avo avo tabi the pekuli. But if you're going to divide up, the one guy's going to get the current coins, and one guy's going to get, for example, the heavy coins. No. That's not good. Why? Because we don't know if that's a proper division, and, and therefore the partnership is not the same. A Sam Havi Moga Dugu Bashita, excuse me now. This is incredible. This, I'm going to introduce this just one second, not later. Listen to this. It, an intelligent person has to ask this question. Here, here. I got a company, I own cars. Uh, here. here, I call them Avis. Avis, they're, they're Avis, they said, they're Avis. They had Avis rent the car. <laughs> they said, they're Avis, I got Avis. So I'm going to rent the car. This, I'll be on cars. He said, do you want a car? Give me every day $10, and you can use my car. Give me $100 every day. You can use my car. Is it legal? Yes. Oh, that great. Isn't that really? What do you mean? You gave him a car, and he gives you back a car plus $100? Isn't that really? <laughs> huh? Oh, so we have to. so we have a big problem. Well, in the end, what, what can be different anyway? Isn't renting kind of like, what's the difference between renting and uh, renting and what? And paying interest. 
What actually is the difference? Okay, so take a look. So look, look at this. Rav Chama had the Mogul Zuz of Gita Viola. Rav Chama had this great idea. He says, well, I know what I'm going to do. I'm not going to lend money in interest. I'm going to rent my money out. He says to the people, he says, listen, I'll rent you, I'll rent you, I'll rent you a Zuz for one-eighth of a Zuz a day. <laughs> oh, he said, he said, so now we see here, but you have to, he says, this is a beautiful point. Let's clarify. He says, oh, he says I got a great idea. I'm, I'm, I'm renting my money out. I'm renting for a zuz a day. Who do you think? Says, okay, I'm totally zuz of Kama. He lost all his money. That's the punishment for taking interest. The person loses their money. So what happened? Okay, okay, okay. Who saw he? But because because his calculation was wrong. Who saw where my shana mimara? He said, look, what's the difference between renting money and renting a shovel? If I rent the shovel out, it's fine. So I can rent my money out as long as I say rent and not lend. You see what I'm saying? He said he figured as long as he makes the deal for renting and not lending, it's the same thing as a shovel. Below you, but it's not correct. He was wrong. Mara, what's the difference between renting a shovel or, or money? Mara, here's why. It's not just the it's not just the language. See, he thought it's a it's a it's a it's a uh, semantics. No, it's actual. There's a difference between a commodity and money. Number one, Mara harder to able. Number one, when you, there's two main points about an object. One, the object that you lend is the object that you get back. He has to give the, the object doesn't become the borrower's object. It's the, it's the lender shovel. With, the whole time the borrower is using it, it's still the lender's, and he has to give it back. That's number one, okay? The, okay, the idea pakte, and also everybody can see the devaluation. The more you use a shovel, a shovel thins out, whatever happens. So you can see it. So there's two points about a commodity. One, it never leaves the ownership of who? Of the lender. And two, we can see clearly, we can calculate clearly what? It's devaluation, okay? So therefore what? So he, he's charging him what? He's charging him for the use of the thing because he's giving it. He's, he, he's getting the thing devalued. Yeah, depre- that's the word I was looking for. <laughs> I couldn't remember depreciation. That's what I was looking for. So he's paying. He's paying depreciation, and he, and and it belongs to the other guy. Okay. So he says. He says. Okay. He says. But Zuzi. But you see. But in the same two ways, money is different. You don't give back the coins that you took. When I lend you money, it's called fungible. They call it in English. It's fungible. You know, I don't own the coins. Where here, I, you own the, you are, you have. It's only, it's only a number. You owe me a number. You don't owe me those coins. You don't have to give me back the coins I gave you. But lo yidi apachte, I know. And even, and even if you did give me back the same coins, we don't see any deva- any any depreciation of the coins. You know, from the, 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 so therefore, what? So that's the big difference between what the one it was there for. And and and, and so and, and and in other words, so the two big things are different. One, when I give you the money, the money is yours. When I give you the shovel, the shovel is mine. I give you the money, the money is yours. I give you the shovel, the shovel depreciates. I give you the money, the money doesn't depreciate. So therefore, what? Those two big ways, it's not lending an object and lending money are different. And therefore, what? So when you pay for the money, you're paying interest. When you pay for the shovel, you're not. Now, this is very interesting. Halacha. A person can say to somebody else, here's four zoos. Go sit upon your zoo. Now, go lend my, go lend my friend money. Go lend that guy money. In other words, you're going to pay the interest up front, so to speak, for that guy to get the loan. Here, here's four. I'm paying you four bucks. Now go lend that guy money. For, at, not an interest. You're allowed to do it. Why? The Torah only forbids interest that, that's paid by the borrower to the lender. So this guy's not the borrower, not the lender, not, not nobody, and he's allowed to do it. it can, he can pay somebody to lend you money. He says also, a person can do the following. He can say to his friend, Shakra lach arba zuzi. He says, here, I'm giving you four zuz. I'll pay you four bucks. And you go and influence that guy to lend me money. I'll pay you four dollars to get him to lend me money. Like these guys in Congress, for that matter. My time, what's the reason? The guy's getting paid for his services. What are they called? Lobbyists. Is it? Yeah, brokerage. Yeah, brokerage. You can go be a lobbyist. Here, here's four bucks. Go get that guy to lend me money. It's also fine. Why? Because I'm paying him. Not, I'm not paying interest on the loan. I'm paying this guy for the service. So talk to the other guy. Yes. Yes. Uh, okay. Now, here, this is interesting. The father... Of of Mar Bredu of Papa, uh, the father of Mar Bredu of Papa, he used to take uh, wax, small pieces of wax, 
three kilos, little little lumps of little pieces of wax, little, little loaves of wax uh, from the wax salesman. And then he said to his father, or excuse me, excuse me, lend the money. You understand? The kid was getting the payback. He was getting the kickback. The kid took wax from the wax sellers and then told his father to lend the wax sellers money. Same thing. That's, that's the case. I'm really a rebel, a papa. So the, so the rabbi said to a papa, I'll call Dega Mala Visa. He says, he says your, your son is, is, is taking interest, is taking interest. And when he says to him, no, she's Kofi Ayu Visa Nakel. He says, any rivers like that, it's fine. It's, it's, it's punitive, it's fine, it's completely legal. Well, the Torah reads above me, love the Malvin. The Torah only forbade the interest that go, that gets paid by the borrower to the lender. Again, he's only getting paid for talking to me. It's fine. He's getting paid. He's, my son's getting paid for talking to me. The same thing. He's getting paid. It's like you said, a, a lobby fee, whatever it is. Uh, okay. Says the Mishnah. Now, you remember, we learned earlier that, that, uh, that, uh, that in Veda Iska, they had to do something to pay the working partner to, in, order to, in order to offset uh, the problem of interest. But now, we quoted this Mishnah before. Now we remember that basically you don't have to offset anything. Why? Because the, because the investment pays for itself. It'll, it'll pay, the investment will pay the, will pay the working partner, and, you know, and therefore there's no appearance of interest. Let's take a look. We mentioned this. Shamim parabachamor. You could take we take a grown cow, a grown a grown cow, and a grown donkey. You can make fifty fifty. We'll call them shlosh Anything and any kind of commodity that works and, and, and consumes it, it consumes it, so, so to speak, its own work covers covers the outlay. The master, you can make a fifty fifty deal. Why? Because everything's going to be there, there's no, every, the, everything's going to be everything will be covered by the by the income brought in by the owner. Okay, Mokom Shinagu Laklot Laklot Ekablados Miyad, places where what? Where the second the babies are born, they, when, the second that the time is up for the babies, they split them whole, and then you split it to exactly the time. And Mokom Shinagu, remember, remember we talked about before how long you have to keep going. Mokom Shinagu Lagado, the place where what? You know, when they make a 50 50 deal, they keep growing the babies more and more to, to a much later stage than you, and then you have to keep going, and the deal stays on, and they keep have to keep growing them. Uh, 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 and they have to keep growing them, and as long as they didn't divide, they have to keep splitting the the akuma. Rav Shimon ben Galil in there. Shimon Eigel in Imo Shimon says what? Well, remember, you can you're allowed to. We talked about this before. You can evaluate the baby with the mother, or the baby cow with the, the calf of the mother, and the baby horse with the mother. And you don't have to give the the you have to you have to pay for the um, for the um, uh, work work of the working partner and for the and for the feed, why? Because it's going to cover it. It's work, the work of the mother, etc. The mother's, the, the 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 work of the worker is going to be covered by the mother for taking care, and the, and the money, the outlay, will be paid by the by the mother bringing in money. You're not going to have a problem. Okay, so you don't, you don't have a lot of work to do. Well, now, but in the, in the last rule is very interesting. Umati sasadeu, a person could increase the rent of his field. Okay. Even when he gave after, after he gives a loan to the to the renter, he can give a loan to the renter and then increase the, the rent on the field. <laughs> Incredibly, okay. And it doesn't have to worry about anything. What's the case? How can it be? I'm going to lend you money. Imagine I, 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 I rent you a field. I'm going to lend you money and then raise the rent. Right, that's it. Well, why isn't that interest? We're going to see why in a second. And the, and the Gemara starts with the end. Tanur Rabbanu we learn. Matis al Sadeh, we learn in the Brisa, al Sadeh when a Koshi Shemidis, you can raise the rent on the guy's field and not worry about it, on, on, on the borrower's, on the field, of, you can raise the rent on the field that the borrower is renting from you and not worry about interest. Case said, what's the case? Asoka says, the Kabila says, a guy's renting a field from his friend for 10 car of wheat per year. Yeah. Romerlin, he says to him, pay me my sign, he says, listen, give me a loan of 200. And I'm gonna I'm gonna invest that two hundred into the field. Why here? So obviously gonna by investing the two hundred loan is gonna the field's gonna be improved, gonna make more money, gonna make more produce. I'll pay you twelve for a week instead of ten. He's allowed to do it. Now, why is that? Okay, why is that? Take a deal. He says, Listen, lend me two I I, I pay you ten car a year now. Give me lend me two hundred bucks. And I'll pay you twelve for a year. The answer is as follows: Why is that? Because what he did was he improved the property for his own benefit because he's going to get more. He's going to get more produce for himself. And the, and the fixed rate that he has to pay, he's willing to go up from ten to twelve. Why? Because the field he's renting is a better field. 
The field that he rented before and paid ten for the produce quote that they had just had it paid ten and not more. If he invests the two hundred that he borrows into the field, okay, one he's gonna make obviously more produce for himself, but the field that he's renting is now that by his own investment is a better field, it's worth twelve. So he pays him twelve. So he's not paying he's not adding two as interest for the loan of two hundred. He's adding two because he's because he's renting a better field by by virtue of the fact that he invested the two into it. That's the case where it's twelve. Every and everybody exactly everybody's a winner. That's why that's why the guy took the deal. Everybody's a winner. Okay, you gotta love Jews. Come on, who thinks this way? It's, it's Jewish. This is so Jewish. I I'm, I love Jews. Jews are like this. It's fantastic. Okay, okay. So he says, "Put your lap." Excuse me. You can't do the same deal with it with a store or with a ship. Why is that? Because because then, let's say you have the store. You're the shopkeeper. You're renting for so much. You say, "Lend me money," and I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna uh, if you lend me money, so I'm gonna be able to buy more more uh, merchandise and make more money for it. So okay, but since he didn't improve the shop, okay. So if he pays him more for rent, then he's paying him interest. And the same thing. If he, if, he, if he says, listen, I'm renting a ship, I'm, le- I'm renting a boat, lend me money and I'll pay you more for the boat. He can't do it. Why? Because the, the money that he, that he lends them, okay, he's just, okay, he, he's just, uh, uh, he, he's trying to get more, since he's only borrowing the money to get more merchandise to sell on the store or more merchandise to ship on the ship, okay, he, he, he ends up, if he pays him more rent for the store of the ship, he's paying interest on the, on the loan. Okay, so that's the difference. Okay, fine, no problem. Um, Rab, we can see a clear division. Um, Rab, not, um, Rab, 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 it's, 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 uh, he says, he says, I'll tell you what. It can even happen that, that that he can borrow the money and pay more even for a shop. Why? Because what's the reason he said you can't pay more for the shop? Because he was borrowing the money. He wants to get more merchandise. But he never improved the shop. So if he pays more money for rent, he's paying interest. But he's not, he's not paying for a better, a better rental. But here, I'll tell you, case, the Shurba Tsuasa, but if he borrowed the money to now to make nice pictures, okay, to make nice forms of pictures on the shop, okay, the subway and say that people are going to, okay, where, where people are going to see it, uh, let's throw it through, uh, 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 he does it to, to make pictures, which is what, you, he, as you're going to see, which is what, is going to make more people shop there, so it's a better shop, or with Svino, or he wants the money to, for the boat, now, so that's why he's going to make a mask, a sail on a mask, he's improving the ship, in both those cases, he's improving the shop and improving the ship. So he said, it's no problem. And he said, what? And what's the case? How are you improving the shop by making pictures? Okay, the subway and say, because people see it and they come in. Okay? And therefore what? So therefore what? It's a better shop. You got a better, like it's like it's better, a better, a more desirable store for you to walk into. Like getting a better location, he pays more. And Svino, when he puts the money into a new mask or a new sale, La Sosa is Cario, to make a mask and a mask and a sale, came into Shapiro is Cario today. Since what? Since now, that with this a new mask, it's better the ship than it was before. Agra today, so it rents for more, so that's fine. The principle is simply, it, it, it's similar to it. If the guy took a loan from, if a guy took a loan from his uh, landlord, that improves the property that he's renting, he can pay more for the property. Got to sell it. If he takes a loan from his landlord that improves his ability to make money, but doesn't improve the property that he's renting, he can't pay him more for the rental. Why? Because he's just clearly paying interest and not paying rent for it, paying to improve the property. Hmm? Here, if I, here, here. okay, if you rent me, if you rent me a field, and let's say for $100 a year, whatever it is, I mean, I'll pay you about, I'll pay I say, let me two and I'll pay you 12, I'll pay you 1200 a year. I'll pay, I'll pay you 100 bucks a year. Let me tell why. And I said, why? Because I'm going to put the money into the field. By me improving the field, I'll, my, my, uh, my produce, I'll make much more produce. And I'm happy to pay you a little more for rent. Okay, I can do it. Why? Because I'm paying you. Uh, the one you can't do is like this. I, so I, I rent a shop from you for hundred dollars. I say lend me a hundred. I pay a hundred. Yes, say lend me a hundred, and I'll start to pay you one ten. And why? Because I'm going to take a hundred and I'm going to buy more merchandise to sell in the store. So now when I pay you the extra ten dollars, what am I paying you for? For the hundred you lent me, because I didn't improve the shop. I improved my ability to make money, but I didn't improve the store. But if I took a hundred dollar loan. And 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 uh, and made a new facade in the store with a shop spire. And I took a hundred dollars and 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 made a new mask for the ship that I was renting. <laughs> as long as I improve the rental property, then I can pay you more, and it's not interest. I'm paying for improved rental property. 
I'm paying you for a higher price, a higher price store. I'm paying for a corner store rather than a middle store. Okay, fine. That's the deal. But, but if I take the loan to increase my ability to make money without increasing the value of the rental, then I can't pay you. If I took the loan and increased the value of the rental, and, and at the same time making my make, make it more money, but increase the value of the rental, and I can pay you more for the rental because I'm paying you for the improved rental property and not for and not for the loan. Then, then he can't. Then he can't. He, then he can't. He can't pay more loan because that, because 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 then he's paying interest on the loan. If he raises, if he pays more rent, he's paying for the loan. If he took, if the money he took improved the property, he can pay more money because he's, he's paying for an improved property. He got a better rent than he had before. He can't pay more rent. He can't pay more rent. He's got to. If he pays more rent, he's paying interest on the hundred bucks. But if he says, "Give me a hundred bucks, and I'm going to, and I'm going to, uh, and I'm going." Same thing. He can't pay more rent because he's paying interest on the loan. But if he says, "Give me a hundred dollars, so I can increase the store. I'm going to put a new facade on the store. It's going to be more desirable. I'm going to make a new entrance rate. It's going to have a few more features." You know, one of the biggest mistakes that people make. You know, you know, tons of. My, I, I love. I, I love doing this. I, I thank God I got a day job. I don't do this. You know, but, uh, but, uh, but uh, I love to study how people make money and read it. You know, because uh, it's amazing. But I see tons of people fail to one B. It's obvious because the access in the street is too far. When the access is too far away, it's not normal. And it, 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 people won't buy. Or as long as it's too far, people won't buy. Today, Bob was on television. He said, "Give me a hundred bucks." You know, you can see it. There are certain things. So the guy says, "Listen, give me a hundred bucks. I'm going to make. I'm going to make a shortcut to the street, to the main street, to the shop." Because he can pay more. Why? Because he, he's paying a hundred dollars was invested in the store, and he's got he's now renting a better store than he was renting last year. He can pay more money. You have to see you have to see what improves the what improves. whenever things fail. I, I watch. I look for in Israel. I watch. It's funny. It's America. It's Americans that screw up the most. It's in the, they, they always made the same dumb mistake. Every American in the old days. In the old days, I was there. In the old days, every American was like, oh, they don't have a hamburger. They call up for the hamburger. No, no. They, they, they never looked to see if there's a market what they're selling. The guy invests all this money. He never looked to see if there's a market. He thinks he's got a great idea, but he's going to buy it. Of course, guy after guy leaves him money. You, you, can't just, you can't just decide that you like the product and everyone's going to buy it. You have to see if people want it first. I got a great idea. Everyone's going to, maybe they will. They do like it. Who says that about it? Who likes coffee? No one likes coffee. Is it? It, it, tons of things fail in Israel because they don't like it. Because they, 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 they don't like what people like. They, they do it. You know what I'm saying? So you have to watch. It's one of these years. There's things that improve. You improve your ability to improve the, the value of the property. Okay, we're both here. Go. This is where you are. What's the second one? Uh, okay. What, what's, what, you, uh, here, Robos, it's, it's, your, it's your decision. It's a serious decision. What do you want to do? I mean, it makes sense to come before. If you want to come, if, what, here, if you want to come early? Yes. Like next Tuesday, next Tuesday, 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 Tuesday,
Okay. Well, boss, everyone will know what for the day. Yeah. I'm running. I got a doctor's appointment. Yeah. Uh, that's fine. Emmy, you don't Thank you. Thank you, or what? Hey, are you going to have a... Um, I'm just going to take this a couple of 